Warm greetings from the high 10. It is Everyday Shenanigans on this Friday, February 28th, 2020. Thanks for joining me. I have a story deriving out of Chicago, Illinois, and it is a crazy story. Once again, the queen is bringing you crazy nonsense, buffoonery, and shenanigans. If you need verification for the storyline, please log on to, to CBS Chicago. Man randomly punching women in the face outside of Harold Washington Library. A man was reportedly punching women in the face outside the Harold Washington Library Friday. Police said several people, possibly nine women, reported being hit just before 9 a.m. Paramedics rushed some of them to the hospital. It is not known what sparked the violence, and the offender has not been located. This is a developing story. If you need verification for this storyline, please log on to CBS Chicago 2. Okay, we have a random bloke running around the city of Chicago punching women outside of a library, public library. Harold Washington, who once was the mayor of Chicago. He was the mayor at the time when I was a child growing up there in that city. I love Chicago. It will always be home to me. So I take this story very personal, very personal. You see, we have a lot of sick people out here, very angry people. And on this fateful morning, this morning, somebody decided to get up out of their slumber and walk up to random women in this city and punch them in their face. And some had to go to the hospital, praying for those ladies that know permanent damage has been done. You know, some people have died from being punched in the face. You punch so hard, cause brain damage, brain damage to the victim. And most of you who are familiar with crime know that Chicago has a lot of crime it is plagued with gang violence, robbery, theft, murder. As I call it, wannabe gang members, because most of them are just a bunch of puppies sitting around with nothing to do. But nonetheless, the city is plagued with unnecessary violence. And this is all the city needs, is worrying about women walking about their daily routine, going to work, running out for coffee, and now some sicko hanging outside the library. I don't know, maybe he's some homeless guy, mad at the world. Everybody's shuffling about. He doesn't have anything going for himself. Or he could be a random guy who has a job. He's somebody, brother, father, husband, boyfriend, but angry nonetheless. But one thing I do know, he is a woman hater. He does not like women. And so perhaps I could say to myself, his heart has been broken. Somebody broke up with him. Somebody said something he didn't like, a lady. Somebody he likes, a woman. She don't like him. His marriage is failing. His wife left him. Oh, the possibilities are endless. But still, he has no business putting his hands on a woman, period, whether he knows her or not. I hope they find him because this is sick to be walking around punching women in the face because you are having a bad damn day. Well, join the club, buddy. Join the damn club. Yeah, the queen's on one. I don't know what is wrong with people, that they cannot cope with their problems. Everyone has problems. Everyone has something going on that they don't like going on in their life. But it, it is up to us to solve and deal with our own problems, situations scenarios and beating up people punching people killing people is not the answer and i pray they find this bloke because i'm praying that when he is apprehended somebody punches him in his face yeah i said it and i don't care eye for an eye you don't care about them why should someone care about you like and share drop your comments below and until the next video, the next update, this is Everyday Shenanigans and Prayers for Evelyn May Boswell. Amen. I'm out of here. Bye-bye.